guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you the ultimate guide to get back on track if you're feeling off or unmotivated. So if you wanna be productive and you wanna get things done, watch this video if you're struggling to do that. I'm gonna show you the tips that really help me when I'm feeling a bit off and unmotivated and how I get back on track super easily and quickly. So yeah, subscribe down below if you want more content like this and keep on watching to get your life sorted out. First thing, make your bed. Yeah, my bed's a mess, so I'm gonna make it right now. Always having a clean environment will make you feel so much better. And if you have no mess distracting you, you will be able to get things done a lot easier. <laughs> you've got a lot of things to do but you just cannot find any motivation to do it i know we've all been there something that has really helped me is writing to-do lists so every single day i will write a to-do list of what i need to get done and i will literally force myself to get everything done before i go to bed that night and if you manage your time well you can easily get all the things you need to get done it's just about getting your mindset in the right place to do those things so for example this video i wrote a list of all the tips i need to mention today i also have a to-do list of all the editing i need to get done for youtube and also as well with school because managing youtube in school can be a little bit difficult but there are so many ways you can do it i like to use a handwritten like physical notebook but there are also so many apps i recommend notion and notion Notability, those are two great apps for noting down stuff. There's so many ways you can write to-do lists and it just feels so good when you check off everything off of your to-do list. Today my throat has been feeling really dry. I'm not quite sure why. Oh my gosh, that rhymed. But I'm gonna go on the buggy quickly to the shop and grab a juice shot. I don't know, they taste really gross, but they like clear your throat. Yeah, but also like just going to the shop and getting like healthy foods to like make some meals is also a good way to just like actually get up and do things. Let's put my shoes on and let's go. My hair is like going all in my face. It's actually such nice weather right now. Like just doing the things that make you happy and like just occupying yourself is the most important thing. Okay, I'm basically here now, so we're gonna see what kind of juice shots they have. Don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Okay, I think I'm gonna get one of these, vitamin C. There's also these ones, I don't know what one's the best one to get. Ginger, lemon, apple, celery. I'm gonna try one of these ones because I've never tried it before. I just moved parking spots because it was a bit busy over there. It's actually so boiling, but these are what I got. So let's try these. I remember them being disgusting, but I didn't get any water. It is. Oh, it's a bit spicy. This is a big shot, no way you could do this in one sip. They both kind of taste the same, but this one's a little bit better because it's got like a sweeter taste. Two shots are done, I'm now on my way back. They weren't bad actually, it just was a bit spicy, but hopefully it like clears my throat. Actually, I don't think it's even meant to clear your throat. It's actually a lot later now. I went out with my mom for a bit, so I just didn't film that. But I'm now back home and I'm going to create a vision board. I feel like this is a really great way to kind of get a vision of what you want to be doing. And if you have it as your screensaver on your laptop or iPad or your phone, whenever you go into it, you see your visions, which I think is super good. And it always keeps me so motivated when I can like see my goals. So I'm going to create a new vision board because I have had my wallpaper for quite a long time. And I'm going to show you exactly how I create an easy vision board. So on my Pinterest, I will put it on the screen, but I link all of my screensavers. So if you want to use any of these, they are on here. So I'm going to use Canva. So you just click on custom size. And if you go to about this Mac, you can see the dimensions of your laptop. So you just put in the dimensions of your laptop screen. And once that's done, it opens up a blank page. And I go into Pinterest again and I will search like vision board or like any goals you want to choose. So I'll search up like YouTube stuff. So I'll find some fun quotes, some like workout motivation and basically just save all the photos to your downloads. they're all here you just drag them into this and you create your collage with the images it is quite easy to do but i find it so fun organizing all the images final screensaver i think it looks super good i'm really really happy with it so now that you've got your vision board done you've got your to-do list done all the stuff you need to do now you've actually got to do those things so reading off my to-do list today i've got to edit a video so i'm going to get a good hour done of editing as i need to upload videos for you guys <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, so it's now a few days later. I don't know why I didn't finish the video on that day. I cannot really remember. But I wrote a to-do list for today, of course. But I've got tutor. Like, it's meant to be literally now. So I need to go and do that. I think it's for like two hours because I've got maths and English. So I've got that. And then afterwards, I'm going to go to the gym because I feel like something to really get your life back on track is to get into a good gym active routine because it's so and I know everybody says this so I'm not gonna like repeat it all over again obviously everyone knows it's good to exercise and be healthy whatever so I'm gonna show you my little gym routine because I've also got a few requests to show you what I do in the gym so I will do that after my tutor so I'll see you in two hours okay bye <laughs> Honestly, if you ask me, this is pure dedication. I just had two hours of tutor, just had dinner, and I just got into some gym clothes, and I'm gonna go to the gym. And it's like seven o'clock at night. That may not seem late to you guys, but I'm usually like doing my skincare at this time, getting into bed, but not tonight. Gonna get back on track, get my life together, because this is the whole point of this video, because you need to stay on top of what your to-do list says, and you cannot give up or go against it. Motivation of the day. But this is a gym outfit. I'm kind of just realizing now that the colors do not go together, but it's all from Gymshark. And I also cut my hair in like the worst ponytail you could ever do. Like, what is this? Sorry if I'm talking fast, the gym closes at 8.30 and it's 7.09, so I need to get a move on. No, I don't spend that long at the gym, I just don't want to be there like too late. I need to shush and go to the gym, so this is what I'm packing. Of course, I didn't shush and I'm back doing a voiceover. So this is my workout, so I started with arms. I did bicep curls and tricep extensions, I think that's what I did at least. And then I did these ab exercises. You guys can see what I'm doing. Some crunches, some mountain climbers, whatever I did. And then I did a run. It was super good. And I was literally dying afterwards. I just finished my workout. I'm now going back on the scooter. That was literally impossible. There were so many people in the gym, so I couldn't really like talk through my routine. But I just did a bit on the floor, some arms, some abs. And I did quite a long run. I did about like 30 minutes. This is not a great look. Anyways, I'm glad I did that workout, but I need a shower. Also, I have a really good gym playlist, but it kind of has a lot of sad songs in it. So maybe it's not the best for the gym, but I listen to it whilst I'm at the gym. I'll put it on the screen, but my Spotify user is mia.stevens27. I recommend having a playlist because it kind of keeps you like motivated. Even when you're doing like school work or working out, it just keeps you like going. So I recommend creating a good playlist, but you guys can always check mine out if you want some recommendations. Also, this arrived from Amazon, so I just thought I'd show you guys because it's right here. Oh, it smells so good. Definitely gonna use this a lot in the summer. It looks super cute as well. Just some ways that I like to stay productive and get on track because a lot of you guys ask me how I stay productive all the time. And I'm not trying to say that I'm always productive because that's definitely not the case. But just some tips to be productive and get back on track. This is what I like to do. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope this helped you in some way. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And if you have any more tips, then comment them down below as well. I usually post at 8pm Dubai time on Wednesdays and Sundays. So set your reminders and subscribe down below. Bye guys.